Ooh, Next up, let's... we come to the DJI block. Yay! Everybody get ready. Everybody oh, get boy. ready. It's DJI time. <laughs> Do All we right. talk well, about we DJI bunch... too much? I don't know, but we had a ton of DJI news. We kind of have to because there's so much going on in the DJI world of things uh, with HD video. Um, so first up, we got DJI backwards compatibility. Two weeks ago, we reported on you that there was a beta leak about the DJI backwards compatibility that happened. I don't know uh, who could have leaked that. <laughs> who knows? But uh, regardless, uh, we got it released for everybody now. So. Yeah. Now you can update your DJI Goggles 2, your DJI Air units, your old version, or your Vistas. You can update those, or your run cam links or whatever. You can update those to new firmware, and they will work with the Goggles 2 in a new backwards compatibility mode. But there are some caveats yeah. uh, to that, unfortunately. One of those big caveats for people is going to be the fact that once you do that update to your Vistas and Air units, you're not going to be able to use those with the V1 or V2 goggles or that old controller, that black controller. Um you know, so that that may be a concern for some people. You can roll back. There's full. You know, you can go back and forth if you need to do that. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, see. Oh, hang on. I meant to pause that. See, this chart makes everything perfectly clear as to what yes, works no with confusion. what, right? Yeah. Yes. Very <laughs> clear. Um, I think the I, I've been getting questions about this for, uh, since I made this video a couple of days ago, a few days ago, and I think the two biggest questions that people are not clear about is that when you update the Vista to make it compatible with the Goggles 2, the Vista is no longer usable with the V2 goggles. Not in audience mode, not anything. That was the other question is audience mode. Uh, there, it, there is nothing, you, it doesn't affect the V2 goggles at all. It just affects the Vista, which now works with the, gogg with the, with the G2 and not the V2. Um, People annoyed that the old uh, the V1 controller is left out in the cold. And and specifically, I didn't put this together, but someone said the people who are getting screwed the most by this, because a lot of people, I want to say, a lot of people aren't getting screwed by this. People who only right. own the goggles too, this is, you're not, this doesn't affect you, right? People who only own the V2 goggles, just pretend this didn't happen. It doesn't affect you. Um, but people who bought the DJI FPV drone, and specifically have the V2 goggles and the gray controller, they, they were hoping that they would get to use the gray controller with their air units, and they can't, and they probably aren't ever going to. Right, because the update that ad lets them uh, use that new controller also makes it so they can't use it with the V2 goggles. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. And anybody who owns the V1 controller also, uh, if you have the V1 controller and the goggles too, this update is also not going to give you what you want. Um, so there you go. And that's pretty typical with DJI. They give you, what I said in the video was they give you what they said they were going to give you, but it often turns out that that's not exactly what you thought and hoped and believed you were going to get. And oftentimes you don't get everything you wanted, but there you go. Um, so yeah. Yeah. But at uh, least we got it. We got backwards yeah. compatibility, and that's what everybody's hoping that would happen. And it happened in December, and it was early December, so that's pretty cool. Yeah. They did what they said they were going to do. They, they also they, they said, said they said years ago, we'll think about making the gray V2 controller compatible with the air units and the Vistas. Now, technically, technically, they did that. They did that. <laughs> years true. later, and not exactly in the way we would have hoped. And they said they were going to give us Canvas or MSP Display Port. Actually, DJI never said that. Caddx did, but they finally gave it to us, but only with the goggles too. So, anyway, thanks DJI. Yeah. Sort of. 